all right all right all right hi and uh, welcome to the video in this video i'm going to be talking about how i developed a python bot that can scrape stories from this website so latest stories every day you will get uh, basically the title the summary and if you want to read more in detail you can go to the link how do i do that right so let's get started all right so i'm not going to show you the complete stuff but um, if you really want to be an expert in web scraping um uh, you know my advice is practice don't just see my code if you see my code that's good but uh, first you do it practically and then try it out if it fails then you can check my code out that's the correct way to learn things right all right enough of that so i observed that every um, uh, all the basically the posts are there in all mode wrapper called as a, a div tag right simply i do that call the find method a get the href and i have all the links to the post like this see just like magic is it, it's so easy i mean i don't know why people say web scraping is difficult you have to do i mean it just takes me like 2 minutes to just write few lines of code okay okay now what's the problem okay i have this okay now what is missing the base url okay let's get me let let me grab that all right let's do that now see it's easy i mean you know <laughs> I mean it's not difficult people say it's difficult I mean I don't know it's just maybe you don't they don't uh, practice it that's all so uh, that's my base url you know same thing it's just one if you if you know if you have done this you know it's the same thing again and again uh, new links base and similarly in the even in node js it's similar i did lot of now i started web scraping in node js and i found pretty much the same thing so uh let's say new links let's try to run this and we should get all the post of the vlogs hopefully up there you go let's go to the first one right here all right i think there is some issue so let's check double check the base url right so oh yeah it does work yeah my bad i actually was too <laughs> so let me go to that one the one right this should uh, basically the first link right should open a post right so meanwhile that's opening let me again do in fact this was posted on january 1st 2020 i mean see it's easy just take the dev tag whatever you know uh, it's just inspect and get the data i mean it's easy and then you can show it of course create an api in flask and you know show it on your website you know do whatever you want right so right so here you can see you can read the entire article now i mean it's piece of cake i mean you know let me just show you one more thing how can i get the summary or the title now see it's just the same thing okay so 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 here you can see it's inside a tag called uh, let me see and dream what about so it's it's inside a tag called as a tag and just call the text dot dot text on that maybe yep let's um so i have the links of course that's good oh, it's, it, it does work uh let's grab the text of that so heading equals to so yeah i'll just do the same thing x dot find a then i'm gonna say dot text method because it's inside the it's a url right uh should work technically so print excuse me headings um now I'm I'm doing it live okay I haven't done it I'm just like recording my video while I'm doing it uh, all right so I was not able to get the data that means I have to do a, I have to dig a little deeper inside let's try h3 now so h3 I should not done have done text here so let's find an h3 tag the class name was whatever all mode title okay now uh, let's try out the heading let's see if we get the uh, html contents should get there you go there you go it's so easy <laughs> scrape websites like charm right so 
Now if I run it, <laughs> there you go guys, you have the title, right? So I mean, it's just easy, inspect and get the elements. I mean, piece of cake, right? Right, let's do this now. Ah, it's easy, it's not a big deal now. It's almost done. So I have the links, I have the title. Let me show you to grab the image URL. Now you'll ask, how do I do that? Guys, same thing, come on. So image URL is equal to, what do I do? X dot find, find what? Find image tag, then do what? Grab the source attribute. All right, that's done. Print. Should get. There you go. <laughs> All right, so yeah, now the same thing. The image URL would be the base URL. <laughs> oh boy, image URL links equals to, of course, the domain name that's the website domain name should be plus the image URL. Wanna grab the source attribute? That's it, done piece of cake let's run this <laughs> there you go guys all the images now <laughs> I mean you know it's easy uh, so you have the images you have the um, what, what was that title you have the links to read that article let's get grab the summary for you and complete this project all right let's see this where is this Okay, it's inside the div tag. Okay, not a big deal. <laughs> That's so easy. Oh boy. They should have done a coding a little better while designing the websites. So summary, uh, you know, x dot find, find all the div tag. Class of that div tag would be this one. And there you go, script. It's easy. Print. Oops, summary dot text. Let's run this. <laughs> there you go, <laughs> easy. All right, so let's just wrap it up, uh, everything. Just pack it, package, pack it up, right? Um, I'm just doing a, you know, I can zip it up like all the links, image and URL. Let me show you basically what I mean by that. Uh, you know, I mean, yeah, I'll just convert this into a library, upload it on my LinkedIn. So just check check out my LinkedIn stuff. So let me just do this. Um, let me show you actually. Uh, let's grab the title. Uh, yeah, you know what? No, let's, 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 let's do this way. Uh, STR, uh, let's say this way title and just to show you okay so title uh, links okay or catch here title links uh, okay image url oh yeah title oh yeah links oh yeah image oh yeah what else do i need title image um summary yeah summary dot format yeah, I know, title, so it's gonna be heading. What else? Then I have links, which would be this one. Ah, oh boy. I have the image URL, we'll go here. And at the last summary, oops, I forgot to say dot text here. All right, that's done. Print str. Print. Ah. I'm gonna print a new line so we can that way see that. All right, the project is complete and let's run it and see. Of course it will work. There you go guys, title, link, image, summary. <laughs> script, the website is script. <laughs> All right, thank you for watching this video. The code of this way, uh, this one would be there on my 
linkedin because i am uh, i don't know I'll, i'll i'll do it on my github maybe later on but it it would be there on linkedin within a day or two okay so hope you have enjoyed this tutorial if so do give a like if you have any more questions please list them your list your questions in the comment section below and i would be very happy to assist you once again keep smiling keep coding see you guys in the next video